right now, the FBI have joined local police in the investigation of mysterious death of Faye Reyes. A few weeks ago, Reyes was found deceased at her home in Lakeville, Pennsylvania. Reports say that there was evidence of a physical struggle. Investigators believe her husband, Jeremiah Reyes, may have been involved in her death, and we will keep you up to date as more information comes in. Hi, my sweet girl. Hi, Mom. How are you feeling today? Did you take your medication? Yes, Mom. I've been feeling good today. Are you going to be here for Christmas? I'm not sure, honey. We'll have to see. I really want you here. You know I would do anything to be there with you for Christmas. Listen, baby girl. I'll talk to you later. I love you. Okay. I miss you. I love you, too. Hey, what can I do you for? Nothing in particular. Just browsing. Quaint little shop you have here. Thank you, miss. Bill, thank God you're here. I don't know what to do. I just bought this for my nephew and I accidentally dropped it when I was carrying it from the car. Oh, Gloria, no worries at all. I'll make it a priority to have it fixed up tonight for little Marcus. I can even wrap it up for you. Are you sure? You don't have to do all that. No, I'd be happy to do it. Oh, the lifesaver. Can't <laughs> thank you enough. No need to thank me. Find everything okay? Yeah. Just appreciating the woodwork. You make all this? Most of it. Who makes the rest of it? I have a few local woodworkers give me a hand when I need it. Any favorites? Got a lot of questions. Heard about a woodworker who killed his wife here. He worked for you? Lady, are you gonna buy something or what? I got shit to do. See you around. How you doing, Steve? Good, how are you? Good, man. Jeremiah Reyes. <coughs> Little early, don't you think? I'm Agent Emily Wright with the FBI. I've been asked to look further into your wife's case. No need. Everyone thinks I murdered her anyways. Everyone is presumed innocent until proven guilty. Yeah, right. Have some faith in the system. The system? Your system has done nothing for me. Your system took away my son. Noah is with Child Protective Services right now. He's fine. But I know you want him back, and this investigation is your only chance. You have a beautiful home. Is this your son? That's Noah. I have a daughter of my own, Becca. She's the love of my life. I can only imagine how much you must miss him. You have no idea what this feels like. Can I take a look at the bedroom?
This is her room. You make this? No, Faye got it from a friend. Did she have a lot of friends? Not really. Not that I know of. Maybe a few friends from work. Where did she work? She was a waitress at a small diner on the edge of town. Had crazy hours. It's the diner in town on Route 17? That's it. I'd like to see the place. All right. I actually have a few things I need to pick up anyways. I'll follow you. Hi. Just two? I'm Veria's husband. I am... I came to pick up a few things she had in her locker. I'm so sorry for your loss. Faye was a wonderful person. I actually boxed up some of her things in the back, if you want to get it. Would you mind answering some questions about Faye Reyes? You're a cop? FBI. Did you know her well? Yeah. We used to work the same shifts. She was such a sweet person. Did you ever see anyone suspicious around her? No. No, not really. Although now that I'm thinking about it, this is the first time I've seen her husband. He used to wait outside to pick her up. He would never come in. At least, not while we were working together. Who came in? Uh, you. Um, you would wait outside to pick her up? You guys would drive off in that little car of yours? You mean that truck right out there? No, no, not a truck. I've never seen that before. Well, who is in the car? I just assumed it was you. Go outside. I need to know. I said go outside before you do something stupid. I'll be there in a few minutes. I'm so sorry. <sighs> you mind if I take a look around? Uh, no, of course. Do what you need to do. Test results just came back for Becca. Please give me a call back as soon as possible. Yeah. Jeremiah! All those nights she told me she was picking up extra shifts, she was fucking someone else! Did she pick up an extra shift on the night that she died? Yeah. Okay. Go home. We'll talk tomorrow, but right now, try to go home and get- No, I can find who did this! I can find the car! I can- Jeremiah, get in the truck. Go home. Now. So, you're the one investigating the Faye Reyes case, huh? Yep. I was asked to look further into it. There ain't no need for that. My boys did the investigation. We got the right guy. I don't believe it's that simple, Sheriff. I need more time. Bill Davis needs to be investigated. Bill Davis? Are you out of your mind investigating Bill Davis? Young lady, let me tell you something about Bill Davis. I know Bill Davis since he was knee high. Bill Davis is a good boy. He's an outstanding member of this community. And let's be honest, the only reason you're poking your nose around here because that murder took place two miles inside that reservation. Otherwise, we wouldn't be having this conversation. As far as I'm concerned, this case is closed. I believe that there's something off about him, and I have new information. Young lady, I don't care what you have, what you think you have, or what you think you're going to do with it. But I know people in the big city, too. And it'd be a shame for you to do something foolish your daughter will regret. You understand what I'm saying?
perfectly. See you later, pal. Later, bud. Sorry about that. Shouldn't scare a lady like that. Ah, it's you, huh? <laughs> you follow me or something? No. You know, you remind me of someone. Oh, really? No one you know, though. Mind if I sit down? No. Day. Not more than usual. You come here a lot? Every now and then. So what's a pretty lady like you doing in a bar like this? No boyfriend to keep you company? What about you? Guy like you must have women falling at his feet. <laughs> Can I get a shot? Yep, same thing. Two? Yes. Cheers. So, uh, still interested in seeing some of my work? Yeah. Yeah, I would like to hear more about it. Hey, here's an idea. How about we go back to my shop and I can show you some? I can maybe even answer some of those questions you have. Yeah. Lead the way. Let's go. Thanks. No problem. After you? Are you like this with all your customers? Just the special ones. Oh, really? Yeah. So you said I remind you of someone? Yeah. She was, uh, she was one of my favorites. You're talking about Faye Reyes. You loved her, didn't you? But something went wrong between you two. What? Did she not want you anymore? Excuse me? That tattoo on your arm. I've seen it before. I've seen it in a jewelry box specifically, a jewelry box that you gave to Faye. I don't know who the hell you think you are, but you remind your old goddamn business. <laughs> she didn't love you enough to leave her husband for you, did she? Is that it? Is that what happened? Shut your mouth! This is just a goddamn mouth where I shut it for you! Jeremiah, back away now! Stop! You fucking killed her, didn't you? Jeremiah! You killed her! I'll kill Jeremiah, you! Jeremiah, stand I'll down! I'll kill you! I'll kill you! Breaking news just into the newsroom. Police have arrested 38-year-old Jeremiah Reyes for the brutal beating of local shop owner Bill Davis in his antique store. Reyes is also awaiting trial for the suspected murder of his wife, Faye Reyes. Officials claim Reyes attacked Davis in a jealous rage due to an apparent affair that was taking place between Davis and Faye. Reyes is currently in police custody as he awaits trial. We will bring you more information as it comes in.